Yo, what is going on guys? Bobby here and today we are back with another video. So today we have the best combination of brawlers in Brawl Stars. Literally, basically in every mode. We are going to have Byron and Colette. So both of these are two undisputed top five brawlers right now in the meta. You guys know just how good Byron is. Easily the best brawler in the game now that Colt and Edgar both got a nerf. And Colette is probably the second best brawler. You can probably debate something else is second. So we'll say at least third. So I guess two top three brawlers. But anyways, what we're going to be doing is double queuing myself and Alec with a random into every mode and just showing you guys how broken this comp really is because having two brawlers, these two brawlers is just, it's so hard to lose with. It is so good. So with that being said, let's hop into the modes and let's show you guys what's up. All right, so we're going to insta queue here. So we're probably facing a really good team. We're going to be playing alongside a Colt. So I'm going to grab mid. So what I want to do is Byron is kind of just poke away. Now, if Alec gets low, obviously I'm going to heal Alec. But what makes this comp so broken is the fact that Alec can get his shield with Colette. And with his shield, I heal him and nobody can kill him. It is basically impossible unless he's taking like eight Shelly supers in the face if I'm spamming him with heals. It is so good. And the Pierce uh, star power, which just released, is also very, very strong. I'm just going to continuously heal Alec over here. Going to kill the Rico. Going to try and kill the Colt. We're going to be able to. Hopefully we get our super soon, please. Please, Brawl Stars. There we go. We're going to be able to get the super. Um, and that's looking like a kill right there. So we're able to get a team wipe. Just going to be shooting that right side. Going to use our gadget to heal up. Going to give the ball to Alec. Just going to heal Alec over here. He's trying to make a play. I don't think he's going to be able to do anything. He's going to try close, but he's not going to be able to. We basically have a goal here, I think. There we go. We're able to hit that shot. Go for the shot. Oh, and Mortis almost gets it, but he's not going to be able to. So that was a pretty quick game. We're going to hop into one more game for Brawl Ball since that one was way too fast. So let's hop into it. Let's show you guys what's up. Hello. I missed my trick shot. All right, so here we go into our next game. And again, we're going to be facing a comp that does pretty well against Alec, but not too good against me. Uh, something about Colette, or not Colette, sorry, about Byron. That makes it really broken right now is that it just completely counters the meta so brawlers like b or colt or another colette you basically just full hard counter now alec is literally just going to walk this in there's nothing that they can do about it that's a free goal for alec he's going to kind of fake a trick shot over there and it's going to be a really quick one to nothing lead this comp is just there's no way anyone can stop it as you guys can see we have a different random now going in with new randoms every time oh i almost got clapped over there by the gadget gonna go for a play we're gonna miss this is not looking good okay i kind of got finessed you guys didn't see that but it's going to be one to one i'm gonna do a little bit of a spin just because i got finessed and that's what you do when you throw a little bit so we're gonna be able to hit that shot on b b's got to be one shot okay b's dead this mr p is really low if i can hit it twice we have the kill i'm gonna pop my gadget just to regain some health without taking too much time gonna be able to get the kill over there now the b again is very low we're going to be able to grab that kill. I'm going to heal up. Going to run forward. And we're just going to super that ball in. Very similar game to the last besides me throwing for like 10 seconds. But really good game. Really easy in Brawl Ball. This is probably the best mode for this comp. Either Brawl Ball or Heist. So that's going to be two games here. Let's move into the next mode and let's keep going. All right. So here we go into our Siege game. We're going to be going up against Edgar, Lou, and Colt. So obviously a really good comp. We are going to have an Edgar on our team. So this could probably work out. We have the Pierce shot loaded. I was hoping that the Edgar would just go for first bolt. Doesn't seem to be the case. We're going to have a really easy kill. Oh, I forgot that it regains health when it shoots you. I probably should have shot it a second time. I was just saving my shots. I was kind of foolish. But either way, we're going to be able to get that bot. Um, we should get that kill. Okay, we have it over there. Let's see. Oh, this is kind of toxic. We're almost able to stay alive. Unfortunately not. Alex going to be able to get a couple kills maybe. There we go. He's able to get that kill. So a really good start for us so far. Now I would play Colette and show you guys some Colette games. But unfortunately my Colette is almost rank 35 right now. So the matchmaking would take forever. But we're going to try and get that Colt. We're going to hit it twice. Need to hit it one more time in order to get the kill. Our Edgar is going to be able to grab that kill. Alec is probably going to go down. He is... I am probably as well. Okay, I'm not going to go down. That's kind of OP. I have two of our bolts, but that's just not going to work out at all, I guess. I was focused in for a sec because I really wanted to get those bolts, but there wasn't really a position where I could. Losing this bot would be okay because we'd rather lose than tie, I think, at this point. 
We're going to be able to get a double kill over there. So that's obviously really good. And here we are in a 4-1 bolt lead going into the last bot. Doesn't really matter how much damage they do. This guy's kind of wiggling around. He's getting those wiggles in. We're going to go for a super. We're going to get really good value out of that super. I'm going to heal up over here. Looks like our random is not doing too much. Sometimes you're just at the, you know, wrath of your random. Whatever he decides is going to happen is going to happen. But it looks like we do have this one under control. That should be the victory right there. We're going to collect as many bolts as possible. Just try and solidify it since they do have a Lou. And Lou is obviously goaded for defense if they know how to play it properly. But this one should be fine for us. Going to kind of waste that super over there. Let's see. All we need to do is 9%. That's one super from Alec. So we should have this one in the bag either way. Alec isn't going to waste his super because we know to win 100% he has to have it. But he's going to go in. He's going to do the damage. And that is going to be the game. I'm going to spin with our Edgar over here. And that is going to be our first Siege game. We're going to do one more for Siege just because Siege is a fun mode and I enjoy playing it. So let's hop in. And let's keep going. All right, so hopping into the next game, we're going to be going up against Byron, Jackie, and Penny. So a really good team. Again, we're going to have an Edgar. So we still have a pretty good brawler. Not too sure exactly where Edgar ranks among brawlers as it stands with the nerf. But I guess we will see soon. Going to be healing Alec here, or at least trying to. He's going to go down, but we're going to be able to grab that kill. Um, let's use that gadget to heal up quickly. Okay, we're going to lose this bot, but that's fine. This Penny's just kind of doing like a ring around the rosy strategy. We're going to be able to get the kill pinching with Alec. Let's see if we can surprise this Byron. Okay, it looks like we're not surprising the Byron. But we're still... Oh, we're not going to get the kill. It's actually going to outplay me. And he's going to get the kill. Okay. So now we got to try because this Byron did kind of embarrass us over there. Going to be healing Alec. He's not going to be able to be killed once he's in his shield like I told you guys before. Don't want to get Penny splashed. Going to be able to get one hit over there. Oh, there's a Jackie. I did not know there was a Jackie over there. So I feel like losing this bot would be better for us since the bolts are already kind of low and we're not going to be able to do too much. They'd have a huge advantage in the next round. So losing this isn't the end of the world, actually. We're perfectly fine losing this. This is actually a really good position for us, especially if we can get that bolt over there that Alec is going for. Okay, we're able to get it. So this is actually a really good position. This is really good for us. We're going to be able to defend this pretty nicely as long as the Edgar actually comes over here. I don't know why he took the long way, but to each their own he's chilling we're gonna give alec a little bit of heals um it looks like i'm gonna need heals too so we're gonna have to go up and win position over here which might be a little bit difficult edgar's gonna go down alex going for plays over here we should be able to get that one kill we're gonna be able to i'm trying to heal alec up gonna be able to hit this edgar a couple times Ed alex gonna be able to get the kill oh and we're gonna be able to keep him alive with the super so we should be fine Looking at the score and everything, it looks like we're going to have a 10 bot. Alec is going to use his super. He's probably going to go down. He is. So hopefully Alec will be able to get a super back. Hopefully they don't defend this too well because it is possible for them to defend this 100%. I'm going to try and get a kill on that penny. I think we got the kill. Okay, we got it. They're defending pretty nicely. Already 60% left on our bot. So that's not very good for us. I'm going to use my heal. Alec is pretty close to chaining super. He's, he's going to be able to. In what looked like to be a very close game, we're going to end up taking the victory. One tick left for the 100%, but we're going to be able to get the W. So again, it all worked out in the end, even though this random, you know, he did his best. He did tick the long way though, which was kind of a wild play. But we're going to hop into our next mode, which looks like it's going to be Gem Grab Snake Shop. Now, this map isn't made for these combination of brawlers. None of the maps we've played really are made for these combination of brawlers, but they are so good together and even alone that there's basically no chance of losing of losing so let's hop into the next game all right so here we go into our gem grab game going to be going up against surge bull and i believe i saw an 8 bits we're gonna have a mortis on our team pretty interesting that we have a mort should be fine although it does get hard countered obviously by the bull doesn't do too well against the 8-bit this bull is being really passive if it just wants to stand here for the entirety of the game i mean i'm fine with that Alex going to get a really easy kill on it. Let's get you some heals. Let's show you some love over there. We're just going to throw our super down. Going to get some value off of it. We need to hit one more shot on that. Just go and take that out. 
this 8 bits over here, Alec does hard counter them. The thing that's really good about this comp is either Alec hard counters them if they're tanks or I hard counter them if they're squishies. So no matter what we face, we don't really have too much of a disadvantage, if any at all. Gonna be able to hit a couple of shots over there. That's gonna be another easy kill. And I mean, this is just really easy mid control for us. They can't really get in. Even though they do counter our Mortis really hard, there's really nothing that they can do. Gonna be able to get another kill. It looks like Alec might go down though. Gonna be able to give him one heal. Mortis is going to get the gems. We got to make our way out of here. Please body block for us, Mortis. Oh no, this is not good. Please. Okay. This is still going to be fine though. Mortis is able to get the kill. Good job by the Mortis for not going for that one gem. I feel like randoms throw by doing that all the time. They think they need to make a play. So they try and grab like one gem or something, but we're going to be perfectly fine. We're going to use our super here and our gadget to make sure we stay alive. This should be a kill. He might jump over it. Okay. Never mind. We're just going to miss instead. But Alec has that left side on lock. We should be able to have this right side perfectly on lock. Our Mortis is being a little bit wild here, but it should be fine. It will be fine. And that's going to be a pretty easy 10-0 win. So again, we're going to hop into our final mode, which is going to be hot zone. And let's see if we can go undefeated in the video with the randoms. Okay, so here we go into our last game here. It's going to be hot zone. So I don't know how this is going to work out because I've never tried it before. But to be honest, we should be fine. So I'm going to hold this zone down here. I think it looks like we have an Edgar again for whatever reason every single random in this game has decided that they're gonna play Edgar so we're gonna hold this zone really well it's pretty easy um, to be honest holding this zone I would imagine because it's literally in your spawn hopefully the Edgar can hold it now I'm gonna go up here with Alec and try and see what we can do over here oh I kind of wasted my gadget I should not have done that I'm gonna try and super that Nita Nita's gonna survive I'm gonna go down for sure Nita's also going to go down though, so pretty even trade. It looks like we're going to hold on to this bottom right and we're going to take it. This Edgar's just getting that finishing touches. He's going to be able to get it. So we're going to move up to the zone over here. Interesting play there by the Edgar to say the least, but we are winning, so I can't complain. I'm going to be trying to chip this guy down over here. So far, pretty good. Going to get that shot. Hit that one over there. Now we should be fine. We do have this pierce. Oh, this is kind of toxic to us. I got to hold this out in case I got a heal mid shot. So it looks like they captured the zone, but there's no way they're going to be able to do anything to us. To be honest, our comp is just way too good with Byron and Colette that they're going to be able to walk over here and do 48% before we were able to do just 21. Going to go for a shot. Oh, I'm going to miss actually there. We're just going to try and heal Alec. That was really buggy. That looked really strange. These guys are actually kind of catching up. I'm a little bit worried. Our Edgar should be able to do stuff. It looks like he might be a little bit laggy. I don't know. Alex going to be trying to make plays over here. We're just trying to heal him as best as possible. We're going to use that Pierce shot. Going to be able to heal our teammates there. Again, just trying to heal. Now it does look like we're looking fine now. I'm going to move up over here. Hopefully this Nita doesn't hit us too badly. Going to be able to pick up that kill. Heal us up. Now we should be able to hold on to this. I don't see why we wouldn't be able to. We're gonna be able to kill the Sandy, 8% left. Please, Edgar, help us out. We're gonna use the heal on ourselves, 2%, one. Alec, all right, there we go. Alec's gonna be able to claim that final percent and that is going to be it. That's a really high team, wow. But anyways, that's gonna be it for the video today. So I hope you guys enjoyed. These two brawlers together are broken. No way you guys are beating them no matter what you do. Like, it's just so good. You literally counter everything. And I would highly recommend running it, especially if you are maxed out, pay to win, whatever you wanna call it. It is so, so good if you have the gadgets and the star power. But that's gonna be it for me today. I will catch you guys again tomorrow. See you guys then. Peace.